It's pretty early in the morning and as you can see the city is pretty empty. Look at this. The streets are empty. Normally you have cars parked all along the roads, but I came here to get my favorite coffee. And it's called Houston. А он что в себе? Скажите, основа какая? Американо. Так, основа американо. Добавляем сироп лимонный и немного натурального меда. Так. Соответственно, в итоге такой получается насыщенный, максимально кислый, ну и, соответственно, прям такой бодрящий и ароматный. Кислый, бодрящий, ароматный. Все Это то, что мне нравится. Спасибо большое. На здоровье. Спасибо, до встречи. Хорошего дня. До свидания. Okay, let's go, guys. Okay, they're not expecting me with a camera. Let's see what they say. Okie dokie! We are both done with the Круто! Вика, как дела? Нормально. Поехали! It was a beautiful hot day, so we decided to go to a lake. Like I said earlier, in the range of two hours of driving, there are plenty of lakes to choose from. We decided to go to this lake. It's called Kaldi. All right, we stopped to get some berries, some blackberries. Wow. Yeah. How much, Risha, how much did you pay for that? 500 troubles, it's nearly, uh, maybe uh, eight, eight hours. Yeah, yeah. It was Saturday and the place was crowded. I mean, really crowded. So crowded you can't find parking. So we went to this private beach called Russian Island. The entrance fee was not bad, just $3 a person. But they gave us a parking spot, so that's good. Basically, it's a huge territory with rental houses in case you want to rent a house. They don't provide any food, but there's a place to cook some food if you want to. And there were even some guys celebrating a wedding. There's lots of water activities. A pretty nice area, except for one thing. There's only one restroom, and it's in a horrible state, so basically just a hole in the ground. No wonder that there's no line in front of it. Do you understand what I'm getting at? What are these people doing to use the restroom? Mmm, yeah, that's what I thought. You know, customer service and standards still got a long way to go. Oh, look who we got. Is that Vika? Hi, Vika. Hi. Man, these huskies are goddamn hot. It's too hot for them. How you doing, poor thing? Then they also have this mini zoo, which How might seem like a good idea and something to get your kids busy with. But actually, it's a pretty sad place to look at. The animals are miserable sitting in cages in this heat. You know, Vika was pretty upset about it. <laughs> You know, Vika, I think these animals deserve better conditions. Mm -hmm. You think so too? Mm -hmm. It's too hot for them. These goats too. Вы их кормите травой, да? Думаете? Травой и морковкой. А и морковкой еще можно? Да, больше ничем. Больше нельзя ничем кормить. Да. Привет. Привет! Тебя как зовут? Меня остался. А очень плохая? Она грязная. Ой, какая большая! Кролики, там видите? Почти не видно. А я поехал. Ладно, ребята, мы пойдем. Пока. 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 Then we decided to go to another lake, and we chose to go to this one. We picked a random remote spot along the lake and, and we thought we might just be lucky to end up being there alone. Well, not on that day. This is the second lake we've come to today. The first one was called Dee. And this place is very different. It's like just camping. If you look around, you see people just setting up tents and uh, some of them brought generators. That's why it's so loud over here. That motorboats over there. People are cooking. On a hot day like this, on a Saturday, it's really hard to find somewhere secluded, you know, where you can have some privacy. So you'll still have a lot of neighbors around you. There's no restrooms, so it's a big question where these guys are going to, <laughs> to 
<laughs> you know, to use the restroom. Now, Grisha, tell me, are you a camper? Yeah, I think so, but um, it's not uh, too wild for me. <laughs> there are too many people. I don't like um, this. Uh, I like more um, wild places. Uh, yeah. it, it's harder to get them, but it's it's better. The main reason is uh, that people can't go to other countries and they go to lakes. Yeah, that's a good alternative. Yeah, because nobody can go to Turkey now, and uh, <laughs> yeah. so people have to be creative. And luckily, the summer's been really warm, so people are people are pretty happy. And especially the ones from Chilabinsk, because there are so many lakes around Chilabinsk. I think it's pretty difficult. It's pretty steep. I know. That's what we'll have to do on our way back. Okay, now that's now that was the fun part. I think we're almost there. That's a little bit of rock climbing for you. Yeah. Learning Cli from the best. At that time it was about 6 p.m. and my aunt called me and asked me if we want to come to our family garden or dacha as we call it to pick up some berries and veggies and uh, and we headed there. So let me show you what our dacha looks like. Малина? Во, смотри, смотри. Давай. Снимай сюда. Давай. Оп, оп. Где она? Вау. Ну у вас красота, тетя Тома здесь. Да. Здорово. Красота. Здесь Леша у нас сидит здесь. Красота. This is your shower place. When you get hot, you take a shower. Hey you, that's my berry. Red, red current. It's almost ready. Вообще да. Можно, можно. Нормально, нормально. Okay, black current. Вика, you want to show me gooseberry? Кружовник. А ближе подноси. Показывай дорогу. Все, дальше своим ходом. Дальше своим ходом? Две банки тушенки, но там мяса почему-то практически не было, знаешь? Садовской суп. Да. Привет, Викуля. Уже со своими кабачками. Привет. Ну, мясо, говорю, это летний. Лига, получила диплом, уже работает. Конечно, мы знаем. Карьера Она просто. Она у нас была. Мы знаем. О, так много тетя Том? А маленькая кастрюлька, и он овощной. Сразу. Ну ладно. Он в, основном, он в основном там кабачок уже садовый, зелень вся садовый. Ага. Скажи, ты что поливаешь? Не знаю пока. Ну как, ты огород же, да, поливаешь? Ням-ням. It's time to eat some berries, guys. Look at these sunflowers. Я вам участвую, я закрою. Вот. Это другой сорт. Mm -hmm. это -то. Я думала, знаешь, вот через неделю будем чуть ли не ведрами, а каждый день по два огурчика вот так вот. Если он зелень, Слава, если mm -hmm. тебя интересует, вот петрушка, вон салат, лук. Красный помидор. I'm picking some mint and some melissa to make some herbal tea. That would be great. You know, people have a garden for a reason. Привет, привет. 
Наши дорогие соседи. Как, Саша приезжает? Нет, не приезжает. Позвоните, пусть приезжает. Некогда им. Ой, у вас сад, конечно, как этот тропический. When I was a school kid, I used to spend many summers in this house. This is the outside, right? The porch. Wardrobe. Over there, there's a storage room. Right behind this door. So let's walk in. The kitchen. So many memories. My grandparents used to live here in the summer months when they were alive. Luckily, my aunt is taking good care of the Dutch now, and it's in a pretty good shape. Я на наверх пошел. Не упади только. Просто комнату. Тут тумбочка раньше была, ее нету сейчас. I think about 80% of Russians have some sort of dacha. Okay guys, that was Saturday. Hope you guys enjoyed traveling with me. Stay tuned for more videos. Let me know what kind of videos you'd like to see.